So John on his show claims that one Anthony Cumia called him on the phone. Now, do I need to explain how out of the realm of possible, that's not a, that's not a term at all. <laughs> Try again. This is not the realm of possibilities. <laughs> Anthony does not call people on the phone. Definitely not stuttering John Melendez. But this is John on his show talking about it. So what happens today? I get a call from Anthony Cumia. Yep. After all these years. And he goes, I told you. I told you. I hope he's going to fucking. I hope he's going to piss you off. I go. Hey. I go. Anthony, why are you calling me today? So. All right. First <laughs> off. I love this conversation. This is all made up. A spoiler. But listen to the back and forth that John is creating in his own head. Where Anthony calls him up and says, ah, you know, fucking Opie, man. He's a problem. And then John's response is, why are you calling me? Yeah, yeah. Hasn't this been established at this point in the conversation? All so right. I, pick, I pick up the phone and he's already telling me how much he loves me. And I'm like, hey, who is this? And that's what he just said. Yes. Why are you correct. calling me? I go, hey, I go. Anthony, why are you calling me today? He goes, well, I had this quadruple bypass surgery. I just said I got to fucking just, you know, you and I had some great times drinking and doing a show, doing a Columbo thing. And uh, I just thought I would just kind of extend the olive branch. I said, that's cool. That's cool. I said, so I guess you saw what's going on with Opie. He goes, yeah, but I, he, this is what he does. He burns bridges. The guy's too stupid to realize that when he does something, you know, it has ramifications. I go, I know. <laughs> and now the dumpster has got me fucking pissed at him. And then he tweets out today that I owe him an apology. No, dumpster. Oh, my God. You Why is John making this up? Is it to make Opie upset? Or is he really trying to get his audience to think that him and Anthony are now friends over this? No, I think he wants Anthony's dialogue in this again. I think it's a bait. I think it's a okay. test, some sort of manipulative tactic. Okay. I mean, I think there could be other ways of going about it, but I love how he is just like, you know, I had a quadruple. It's like he had surgery. It's not the 12-step program. He's not fucking <laughs> right, making yes. amends at the end of this. Like, what the fuck are you talking about? The- the surgeon told me I had to call all my enemies <laughs> up. But yeah. what? It's not good stress on your heart, sir. You really <laughs> should, right. you know, uh, right, make amends with dipshits. <laughs> but that, that's why that's why it's so obviously a, this is a made up conversation to get under Opie's skin because John leaves out all of the things that made John mad at Anthony about like, he's just like, right. Oh, I yes. forgave. As soon as he called me, I forgave him immediately about calling me out for not being funny, calling out my kids for being, you know, like just shitting on my kids and everything yeah. that he's furious with Anthony about is, is not a non-issue. They're just like right on the same page about shitting on Opie. It's just yeah. so obviously made up. Anthony did an hour on what a shitty father John must have been. And to think that he would then call John and John would be like, oh, hey, why are you calling me? Oh, yeah, I hope yeah, he does suck. It's according to John, the bridge. Right, according to John, his kids is the most important. He's the greatest father in the world. If he gets that phone call, you'd think he'd be like, you motherfucker, you got some balls calling me right now after the shit that you said. It says just like, oh, yeah, no, I know, I hope yeah, I, I don't want to work, huh? <laughs> Wait, Anthony doesn't even call me. I know. I mean, I'm, a, I'm honored. I actually still feel like like a radio listener when he picks up when I call. <laughs> I'm like, right. oh my God, I'm on. Am I on? Like, <laughs> First time, long time. <laughs> yeah, right? yeah. uh, wait, the last time he called me, which I honestly want to say is the only time he called me, was when he, he admitted himself into the hospital the back yeah. recently. And when he called me, I knew something was wrong. So right. it's like to get him, to have him call you, let alone get him on the phone is just very rare you'll get very, you'll get like a text back maybe a couple hours later but it has nothing to do with the fact that you called him <laughs> yeah this is silly you owe me an apology oh, that's the other thing too all these grown men need apologies and shit what the fuck world do we live in what would they do it. for you i love it bring it's it so over here st- <laughs> <laughs> it's so st- <laughs> all apologies here we get podcasts <laughs> I fucking defended you and defended you and defended you. 
And then you fucking trash me on Twitter. And then you fucking stop putting everything on me when it was you. He doesn't even know what he's talking about. Hey, I'll get Vincent. I should t- I, I should get the fucking Bessie <laughs> on here. Show us, your your recent call. Friend. show us your fucking because recent Vince call. Yeah, you. right. Yeah, I want to see that shit. Vince, Just fucking show Who started and- this? <laughs> and Vince is a smart guy. He's going to go, oh, he did. Is so then he? we have to get Vince the lawyer on to ask who started this. <laughs> John, Vince is not your friend. And this is why. You're a child. And you're very difficult to be friends with. I have to get phone calls from you to come on air like he did with Joey C. Like he does to everyone. He calls them up. Who started this? <laughs> Who cares? Opie started it. <laughs> and that's the truth. Okay. Opie fucking drew first blood. So, Opie, don't start crying now. Okay? Because now I'm going to make your life miserable. You know, because I'm going to talk about you every fucking day. Oh, yeah. God, he talks about me every day. in your mouth. Jeez. Just, I, I love that he thinks he has any there. power on his show. He talks about me every day. My life is not miserable. It's just the opposite. Very, so, very lucrative. You're, yes, you're not going to hurt Opie in any single way. So let me just show you the tweet that uh, Anthony put out once he was made aware of this. Okay. <laughs> So he posted this clip that we just played. Here's the clip from this drunken imbecile. I assure you I didn't call this guy. Opie and I haven't trashed each other in a while, and I just like to keep it that way. This is John being the intoxicated problem that he is. I just got a text from someone who said, Suttering John is on the show, saying I called him and patched things up. This couldn't be further from the truth. I haven't even talked about him in quite some time, never mind talking to him. I don't know what his motive is here, but I'm sure whatever it is, it's destined for failure. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I, so I, I, when i go. asked him and he sends it to me and i would just mention the point out i'm like wait you didn't call him did you like like i'm we're not sure right. like you didn't call him did you and he's like just no like why would you I do got, that like, 80 oh no and i was like okay i just wasn't sure like he was like i'm so <laughs> I texted Anthony. I was just like, I'm glad you patched things up with John. It was great to hear. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> I still think also, and I sent it to you, uh, Carl, was the tweet that John had after. And it was like, it just shows you that he has no interest in the patching up. He just wants the shit to be stirred and pointed yes. towards him to have this leverage of victimhood. And, and now... Um, you know, ammunition of like, you shit on me. Now I have reason to, it's a, it's a, it's a pretty shisty like way of, you know, attack. And he, uh, when he, he says as much as I despise Pocky, it was finally a decent move on his part to call me and extend the offer. We found mutual ground. and was discussing the inane, inane complexities. That's an oxymoron. He's retarded of the dopester. (laughs) But then he goes, but then he continues to shit on Anne, and it's like, wait, what do you want? What do you want? He goes, oh, yeah, he also assaults women. He lied about that. And it's like, you don't see oh. that right there. It's all about just trying to stir this up again yep. to kind of feel like you are the superior person in all of this, and you're not. Isn't it interesting? So I think if I could just wrap all of this up in a bow here. If we could. What we're seeing is between Opie Kevin and Stuttering John, these are three people who need attention any way they can get it, are going about it in all the wrong ways. And it, it's desperate. You know what? I'll, I'll leave Kevin out of it. I mean, he's, he's been talking about Opie for a while here. Opie and John are both realizing that they need us more than we need them. And so now they're trying to insert themselves into this world and it's really sad and, and pathetic. pull other people into it like and yes. he has no fucking part of it he doesn't right. care He's yes. like, he doesn't really give a shit and then he pulls it this way and then he knows how to provoke him and this is what he gets and he kind of got what he wanted john's neglected cat says i hope if someone did actually call stuttering john pretending to be ant that they had the foresight to record that conversation <laughs> i believe that Cal- if john's in california i don't think you can release that i think that's a uh, Two party state, right? Or is it a what? Maybe California isn't. I don't know. But I don't think there's a high probability, phone call. though. There's I, no way there was a phone call. You know what I mean? That, that would be so ridiculous. <laughs> hey, I just want to call. I want to bury the hatchet. You know, we used to drink and we did that Columbo thing. Like, 
all stuff that's like publicly known about the two of them. Remember we had that poker game? Anyway, I just wanted to say we're cool, right? Who are these podcasts?